Hello, everyone. This is Kip from the Kip and Dave Show coming to you live from the headquarters here in Stillwater, Oklahoma for Kicker. And we've got a new toy we're going to show you today, and it is our amplifier dyno. There's a lot of test channels out there where they have one of these amplifier dynos and they show you what the power output of an amplifier is at continuous RMS and even dynamic burst power. And here at Kicker, we thought it'd be kind of fun to get one of these and show you the power output on our amplifiers. Today, we're just gonna test one in particular and that is our new CXA 400.1 and we're gonna run it through the amp dyno here. We rate all our amplifiers at 14.4 volts, so that's the voltage we're gonna use on this. To make sure we get plenty of juice to our amplifier, as you can see here beside me, we actually have a complete stack of Astron power supplies. There are seven of them, they are 50 amps a piece, so we have 350 amps of current to provide to our amplifier. So we have plenty of juice to get the amplifier under test. And I'll step back here a little bit and show you. Here's the 400.1 connected. As you can see, it's four gauge power terminals connected to our blocks for power and ground. We have our eight gauge speaker wire coming out and hooked up to the amp dyno. So we're gonna run through some testing. We're gonna show you 14.4 volt continuous power at a four ohm load, at a two ohm load, and into a one ohm load. And then we'll also show you a dynamic burst test into one ohm to show you what power this little 400.1 actually develops and creates. So hang on while I turn around and push a bunch of buttons and you'll get to see some close up shots of the screen showing the actual power runs. So this is our run into a 4 ohm load, 14.4 volts. The amplifier is rated to develop 150 watts and on the amp dyno we've got 170 watts out of this little amplifier. So we're going to back up and do the next test which will be 14.4 into a 2 ohm load. So this is a 14.4 volt test into a 2 ohm load. The amplifier is rated for 300 watts and here on the amp dyno we've developed 309 watts here at the end of the test. Now we're going to test at 14.4 volts into a 1 ohm load. and the sound of the relays lets us know the test is over. So here we are, the little amplifier that we call our CXA 4.1, rated at 400 watts into 14.4 volts, and it just developed 514 watts into one ohm. Now we're gonna back out and we're gonna do a dynamic burst test into one ohm. This will be a 14.4 volts into a one ohm load. And the test is over, and in a dynamic burst test, we've got 592 watts of power. So this little amplifier, CXA 400.1, rated at 400 watts, it doesn't just make 400 watts, it makes a whole lot more than 400 watts, and it makes all the power that we specify in the amplifier into both a 4 ohm, 2 ohm, and even a 1 ohm load where the amplifier is designed to operate. And into you know, a dynamic burst, it does an amazing 592 watts. So check out the CXA 4.1 at your local Kicker dealer or here on Kicker.com. If you have any questions, be sure to hit up our tech guys, drop any comments or questions in the social, and we hope to see you soon.